Hi everyone, it's Arlene, and I'm doing this quick uh, part one uh, video on the uh, de de dehydrator. So it's going to be an experiment with if the dehydrator really does work um, to dry out the soaps. So I'm going to test the pH um, as soon as the batter is made and when I pour it into the mold. So that'll be part one. Part two will be tomorrow when I actually cut the soap, you know, unmold it, cut it and test, test the pH then, and then part three will be once they're in the dehydrator for, you know, about a day or so, you know, about a day, maybe a little bit less, maybe 12 hours, 15 hours, then I'll test the pH again. So today I'm making my, um, my tea time, um, soap. Now this is not a tutorial on my soap, so please don't write and say, oh, how much, what are your oils, how much honey, like this is just, I'm making this soap just to do the test for the dehydrator. All right, but I do, I am soaping at about 100 degrees, you know, a little bit less, 90 between 100. I have my oils all melted here and cooled down. I do have my um, one bag of uh, tea leaves, the dried tea leaves in there. My lye solution here is brewed tea. So the water, that's why it looks so dark. I don't know if you can see this. I can't find my tripod. I apologize. I haven't had my tripod in months. So that's why I really haven't been taking that many videos. But I do have my lye solution here, which is my tea water, my brewed tea, and the lye. So I'm going to add that now to my oils. Oh, and I also have my uh, chamomile uh, powder in the oils. So I'm just going to pour that in. Let me get my scraper here. Let's get all that tea water and that lye in there. I'm just going to stir this up a little bit. It does look really dark now, but it does lighten up a lot, you know, after it sets. So I'm going to start stick blending that. Once it comes to a light trace, I'm going to add my, I took some of the tea water out and I mixed it with some vitamin E and my 100% pure honey, which I have here, and then I'll be adding my fragrance. Got a really, really, really super light trace right now. Let me just make sure this is still taping. So right now I'm going to add my honey with the leftover tea water and my vitamin A. I'm going to add that. Get every nice drop of that vitamin E and that honey in there. Then I'm going to add my fragrance. I put about three and a half ounces. This is a full four ounce, so I'm not going to add it all. I'll leave a little bit out. And even though it has vanilla in it, because I want the soap to be dark, like like a iced tea color. I'm not adding no um, titanium dioxide or anything. Oh, I love the smell of this white tea. And then with the honey and with the brewed tea water, 
chamomile powder, vitamin E, and honey. It just, oh, it's such a wonderful bar. I sell a lot of these soaps. Okay, that's real nice and thick now. It's my Aunt Ruth's favorite, actually. Little Mommy, I'll let you out in a second. Mommy's making soap. My little baby. So I'm just going to pour it in my mold. And I don't do anything fancy with this soap. There's no piping. There's no, you know, little doodads on top. It's just straight, beautiful tea. A tea soap. I absolutely love the way it smells. And then I do stick it in the refrigerator. So it is going to be refrigerated because of the honey that's in there. Um, it does end up gelling on me a little bit in the middle. So I always get a little dark circle in the middle. Clean up these edges. Monkey, please stop. Hey, mommy said wait a minute. So now I'm going to take the test strip and we're just going to dunk it in. Leave it for a couple seconds. I'm going to wipe it off. Let's see where we're at here. Can you see this? We're probably... Looks like it's between 13 and 14. Like right around 13 is the color. Alright, so that's the pH on it. Now, my chamomile flowers, I put a little tiny... I don't like the big flower pots. Where's a container? I put, um, what do you call it? You know, I like the, I'll just wipe it up after here. I like the little shreds. I forgot to get this together before I set everything up. So there you have it. It's my, I call it tea time. And it's the white tea fragrance with some honey and chamomile chamomile powder inside, some vitamin A, the tea leaves inside of it. I only use one bag of the tea leaves. And then just a little bit of chamomile stuff on top. All right. So I'm going to stick this in the fridge and then I'm going to test it tomorrow when I take it out to cut it. But for right now, the pH is about 13. Between 13 and 14, actually. Okay? So, this is part one, testing for the dehydrator. All right? Everybody have a great day. And I will make the other video tomorrow when I cut it. Got to get this baby in the fridge. <laughs> All right? Thank you so much, and I'll talk to everybody soon. There you go. There's the soap. Okay, and it looks like it's just in time because my battery is starting to die. <laughs> All right, I got to run out and get more batteries tomorrow to fit to complete the um, the experiment. All right, so everybody, stay tuned. Have a wonderful day and happy soaping. Bye.